everyone welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is Gugum Kize welcome um, I'm gonna give you a, like a moment of silence for you to hit the subscribe button please because you're here so you might as well and I never ever mentioned in my videos that subscribing is actually free so go ahead and subscribe please I really appreciate it be on the road to 1k so please do subscribe and oh i'm itchy sorry please do subscribe and let a friend know to subscribe and watch some of my other videos um if you're already a subscriber this one's for you darling thank you so much for subscribing for the comments for all the love for sharing i really appreciate it so thank you thank you this i want to mention um before i forget i did a video um if you haven't already seen the video i did a video on gentle magic and i've been getting a couple of comments on it i have oily skin so um the products worked well for my oily skin but i think you if you have combination to dry skin rather not because then it might dry your skin even further because if i was using it with oily skin and i have super oily skin um and it was making my skin matte then i don't think you should try it with dry skin because then i think it will do more damage than it will good so that's just one um, one thing to remember i will link the the video somewhere on this this video is my bun not cropped out um i'll fix the, ca the camera in a bit so okay much better we're gonna get into this week's video i'm just going to be doing talking about some of my favorite products that i've currently been using during um lockdown i think everybody knows that it's lockdown and you know when lockdown started things were okay in terms of content but as time um as we're still in the lockdown and we like there's a bit of restrictions i'm sure you can tell from all your faves um, on YouTube that there's a difference in terms of um, the content the content that's being put out so obviously that's why my video is also different to what I would normally do but I think this is one that I'm gonna start doing going forward just discussing some of the products that I love um, that I've been using so these are in no particular order I'm just gonna I put them all here so I'm just gonna grab whatever it is and tell you why I like it um, I will not say the prices um, as I'm talking about the video as I'm talking about the product rather I'll just um, when I edit I'll put the price on the actual video so that I just because some of the prices I can't remember off the top of my head so instead of wasting time and trying to figure that out I'd rather just list it at the end of when I'm editing so my first one my first one um i have amazing teeth they're gorgeous look at my smile yes so no i'm teasing but i love my teeth um so i have um this really amazing smile great teeth but um if you're close to me and we've went out and we've had anything to eat together i don't think i've done uh, a mukbangers yet um, no, I don't think I have so you won't know um, I have the worst Like my teeth um, Tooth sensitivity is something that like I just am not coping with so um, I went to my dentist at some point and he recommended that I use the Colgate sensitive pro relief because I was using sensodyne because of the ads that they posted that does that stuff doesn't work if you have anything close to what I have in terms of tooth sensitivity uh, Sensodyne is just like it's games so I don't even look at that section I don't even entertain the fact that they say it's for tooth sensitivity that's a lie so I use the Colgate sensitive pro relief um, I like this one because um, you can brush with it and then you can also um, before you go to sleep because sometimes I will wake up with like that sensitivity on level 1000 so when I try to have breakfast or whatever after brushing my teeth it's really sore so what you can do is just take a tip with your finger and then rub it on the areas that normally give you problems in the morning while you're brushing because you can feel when you're brushing that actually this is a little sore or whatnot so um, I use a little bit of this at night before I go to sleep and just rub it on the, the areas that give me the problem areas and um, 
in my mouth so i love this one this is what it looks like ding, ding, ding. so that's one of my faves currently the second one i'm gonna do is i'll grab this one the head and shoulders anti-dandruff moisturizing scalp care um with aloe vera extracts it's hair food that is what it looks like and i have a big bottle which is 450 mils um I d the 450 mils is actually a little bit hard to find but it is it's not impossible to find um i like this one because i suffer from dandruff i have oily skin but i have a dry scalp and i have a dry body i don't know how it works um so yeah i have a really like i have a problem with dandruff so for years i've been using head and shoulders to wash my to wash my hair but then when they introduced the hair food i said let me try the hair food and this one is for um african it's for african scalp um it's for the african scalp so this the, the particular collection says african scalp and hair care so i decided let me get this and try it because now the one i was using all those years ago was the one for for everybody but i think they made it with um caucasians in mind at the time when they were making it so it would sometimes dry out my hair but i wouldn't have dandruff i don't know how that worked so i tried the hair food and it works great especially because sometimes when you base your hair try not to base your hair all the time because i've realized that it also gives you dandruff but when your hair needs a little kick because it's really dry then um you can go ahead and you can go ahead and base your hair you yo i haven't done this in a long time clearly um yeah and this is what i use for that it's a big one so if you're gonna base your hair every now and then this thing could last you well over a year ah uh, my face this is if you could feel this you would know that like there's probably like that much left so i normally buy two or three at the same time um this is the new range the dawn um the dawn 100 percent natural moisturizers and i got the one the blue one the repairing body lotion and it says it helps reduce the appearance of stretch marks it's got vitamin e and argan oil i have stretch marks um and stretch marks don't choose like oh you're smaller or you're bigger or whatever i'd like to believe at some point somebody gets stretch marks as a woman i think even even guys get stretch marks yes but i have stretch marks if you don't have stretch marks sis let us know what you're using um and so i use this lotion i liked it because um it said that it also helps with stretch marks and it's got vitamin e and vitamin e has like healing properties within it um and it's also got argan oil i cannot for the life of me remember what argan oil does but i will figure it out and let you know when you when you're watching the video you'll know um so i like it because it's also got a really nice smell it's not too it's not it's fragrance but it's not over fragrant so you're not walking out there smelling like dawn you know what i mean so i like it because of that as well um it's really cheap compared to the vaselines and all the other stuff that is on the market for like in terms of body lotion it's really um the affordable choice um and that's why i like it it's also because of it being cheap um one thing about it though that i've noticed as it's getting a little bit colder um it doesn't moisturize as much because remember i told you that my um from this part here so like from my neck not even no from my shoulders down i have dry skin so um when it gets colder it gets a little bit dry and this doesn't really help um moisturize as much as it does in summer or spring so i normally add a few drops of uh bio oil tissue oil or vitamin e or whatever oil i have at home but a lot of the time i have um bio oil at home so i just add a little bit and i mix it if you don't want to use bio oil you can get um the tissue oil from clicks you can get um vitamin e oil from clicks as well you can check for the discount brand as well i've never personally seen the discount brand one but i hear that they do have so you can check that and then mix it with this so that it doesn't dry you out as the day goes but other than that if you don't have super dry skin in winter 
this is amazing it's affordable and it smells really good so the next one because i already spoke about it i gave it away is bio oil this is how much i have left and this one is a 200 mils yeah 200 mils bio oil um i think we all know why we love bio oil it's super great for stretch marks um and it's not you know when you hear oil you think oily it's not a greasy kind of oil so after you've put it on you don't have like that all that shine on your hands and it's slippery and oily i hate that kind of thing like i hate a greasy oil i don't know if that makes sense but yeah i don't like that so i like it because it's um it a it's fast absorbent i think that's why it's not oily on your skin afterwards um and it's great it works for stretch marks it works for scars as well so i like it because of that and it actually works like if you've taken the time to use bio oil you will definitely see results what i'm not um crazy about in terms of bio oil is the price it is a little pricey i bought the 200 mils because it was on sale at clicks at the time when i got it but um it's not the cheapest thing to get do you know what i mean so if you have money to get the big one then go for it it lasts a bit longer if it's on sale then definitely go for it because then it goes on sale every now and then once in a blue moon so if you see it on sale then do best and get some of it um for oh for stretch marks i use it mostly for stretch marks and scars yeah what is next I have braids and when I've had braids for the longest time I'm only gonna undo these things at the end of the month so that I know I've enjoyed my money I've gotten my money's worth in terms of these braids so don't ask me okay now that I've got that out of the way I'm gonna go into it this is the restore plus braid spray plus coconut oil it says it relieves tightness and restores shine it's for dry braided hair I bought this one at pick and pay I needed something for my hair because it was getting really really dry and you know when you base um, braids sometimes it like you have too much oil on it and it starts making those like chemically marks chemical marks rather on the bottom of your braid so I don't like that so I ended up getting this I said let me get a spray instead hopefully it will work I use this stuff this stuff moisturizes your hair like I was surprised when I got it I thought no, I'm just grabbing a hairspray um, I just need it because right now my head is like I'm going crazy from the itch because my head is dry my scalp is dry and I got this it moisturizes your scalp and it also keeps the hair that's you know entwined with your the hair piece in your braid moisturized so this one is great if you want um, something to keep your scalp and the hair within the braids moisturized feeling fresh and it also smells nice mm. oh. it also smells nice as well so it's not those sprays that work but smell terrible sulfur 8 hint hint um yeah it's not one of those so i absolutely love this one as well the way I haven't recorded in such a long time, like, I feel like you can tell. But anyway, please bear with me. Um, this is also another one. <sighs> Guys, I fight stretch marks by all means. If you can fight it and you can help prevent it and you can keep your skin moisturized at the same time, that's, that's all about, like, that's what I do, rather. I prefer to i think prevention is better than cure so if i go in to fight stretch marks i tell you i go all the way in to fight it so that's why i also have this a lot of people this is happy event by the way a lot of people happy event um uh happy event massage lotion with pure olive oil fragrance free i prefer the fragrance free by the way which is the one that's got that like, that olivey green color versus the one that's got that pinkish peach color i despise the smell of that so a lot of people will associate happy event with pregnancy and pregnant woman that's not always the case 
if you if you for a fact have been pregnant or you know somebody who's been pregnant and has used this and you can see or you know that they don't have stretch marks anymore then clearly this needs that needs to be a testament that it actually works so that's why i love happy event but i prefer the uh, fragrance free one because mm, the other one isn't the way so again i will take some of my bio oil add a couple of drops in there mix it all up and have a you know a cream i have stretch marks on my thighs so i use this for my thighs so it lasts long if you have stretch marks all over your body you can use this all over your body if you can afford it it's not the cheapest thing to get but it does work i know a lot of people also talk about palmas i've never used palmas so i can't speak anything to um how effective it is for me but happy event for me is great add a couple of drops of bio oil and you're ready to go use it every day twice a day on the affected area the area with your stretch marks um or areas that you're prone to get stretch marks because i said prevention is better than cure use it there and you you will see the deep the difference because i've seen the difference too it really works it's great for me i love it the next one is the dark and lovely braids and weaves new waterless no rinse out scalp wash um and then it says it also removes um flakes it's anti-flakes it's got jojoba oil and peppermint oil and it's for weekly use that's what it looks like and that's what the top looks like Ugh, for you to apply it so that it's easy to apply this is a new one the one i opened i cut it too much so i can't close it anymore so that's why i opted to use a new one this i just go in the lines i just follow the lines of my braids the outlines of the braids and um I rub it in with my fingers so that it gives my hair that fresh feeling and it's not feeling too heavy from all the chemicals from the sprays and everything especially if you plan on keeping your braids for long this one is a great idea for that to keep you feeling fresh and your braids um, looking pretty or nicer for longer so that's why i love this one this you can get at clicks and discount most of the ones that i mentioned in fact all of them you can get at clicks and at discount the next one is the dark and lovely au natural uh let me turn it around to the english part plaiting pudding cream um and this one is for braiding for twisting and threading i love this just to moisturize my hair i feel like it gives my hair that extra moisture and when i say my hair i have an afro so it keeps my afro nice and moisturized easy to comb i know after i undo my braids i will wash my hair i actually should do a video on that to show you how i do my afro anyway story for another day this is what i use it keeps my hair super moisturized i can actually comb it out properly i can tie it up i can twist it easily without it being painful um or tangling or any of that so i love 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 this one this one i bought a while ago before they changed the package so don't be surprised just um when you get when you get to clicks or disc cam just um double check that it's the pudding cream and then you'll know it's the same one that i'm using i don't think they've changed the formula but i do think i do know they've changed the the packaging from this lady to a different lady the next one this one i got from Diskim. it's a gold coast chemical exfoliating body scrub uh, it's got vitamin e activated charcoal it's got vitamin e and activated charcoal it it is a how big is a bottle 250 mils it was made in south africa in cape town this is an awesome body scrub just when you you know when your body starts feeling heavy and you feel that you've got like dead skin cells that you need to get rid of so that you're feeling nice and fresh and nice and clean this is what i go for because it's got activated charcoal i know it's doing the most in terms of scrubbing my body and getting rid of all the unnecessary stuff that i have on <laughs> all the unnecessary stuff that i have on my body so this is why i like this one it doesn't really have a smell per se 
yeah it doesn't have any smell but i can tell you it does the job and it's quite big for a exfoliating scrub because you don't normally get them this big anymore so this, this is one of my favorites as well last for this month of may is the Veet in shower hair removal cream silk and fresh uh so silk and fresh technology it's for dry skin because i have dry skin all over my body um and so it's got shea butter and lily fragrance this is what it looks like mm, yeah so this one's awesome because i love taking showers and when you're shaving you don't when you're in the shower and you want to shave you don't want to be in the shower forever because you're shaving so this one is it's awesome because you just put it on wait a little bit while you're showering and then wipe it off so it makes it much easier to use than actually using the traditional um razor or the cream that you need to leave in there and then wipe with something dry this one just works better because you're in the shower even if you wipe it with something wet or you let the water run it uh will shave your legs perfectly every single time it does not leave your legs um dark i know some of these shaving creams leave you dark especially the ones for your underarms they make you really dark i haven't seen any dark patches or dark marks since i've been using it so that's why i like it and i've decided to like i keep buying it over and over again because i haven't had any issues with it before and it doesn't have a foul smell can like these shaving creams not have this horrid smell like as well like it doesn't need to smell disgusting for us to know that it works so those are my favorites for the month of may we're almost at the end of it in any case so this is what i've been using this is what i love these are some of the products that i hoard when i can as i told you um i hope you enjoyed the video let us know what some of your favorites are and what you use for stretch marks what you use for dry skin it may help somebody else it may also help me so please do comment in the section in the comment section below don't forget to like the video to share it and also to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already because we are almost at, well we're at the end of the video in any case so please do subscribe and i know some of you watch my videos like watch a couple of my videos and don't subscribe please do subscribe sis like I me mean, it's free so yes I will see you in the next video go ahead and watch some of my other videos that you haven't seen already because i have a couple of videos out for you to enjoy during this lockdown um yes thank you so much i hope you enjoyed it Mwah.